Hi everyone, uh, sorry I look like a zombie. <laughs> I pretty much just got up about uh, 15, 20 minutes ago and uh, I had a pretty crazy night and uh, <laughs> I feel really good today but honestly I look like crap. But I slept, uh, I got home pretty early and I slept until, oh man, I went to bed around 2 and just got up around 12 so it was much needed and uh... it's the only day of the week that i can actually get away with doing that so i'm like today if i want to sleep till two that's what i'm gonna do so so i did i took it till twelve and i was like okay let's get up <laughs> i didn't actually let twix out at all well i think i let her out like five i don't know i was still kinda my brain wasn't exactly here so but i remember going to the bathroom at five and she got out but then i woke up at like six or seven and she was there so she must have uh, got back in when I came back, but as you can see, she's pretty tired, I guess. She must have had a long night, I don't know. Um, not too much to talk about today. Uh, the weather looks like it stayed about the same. Um, yesterday, uh, February 1st, uh, House of Cards on Netflix premiered. So I'm really looking forward to that. I think just the, uh, oh, there's 13 episodes it shows, so... The ratings are low, but it just came out Monday. But it's got uh, Kevin Spacey, Robin Wright, Kate Mara, and it, and I really like him because he's really good, like evil person in movies. If you know what I mean, like he's a really like in this one he plays to say ruthless congressman Francis Underwood will stop at nothing to conquer everything in this wicked political drama about power, sex, and money. So it's going to be political, but. I, he's been really good in uh, other stuff similar like you know like leadership stuff like that but obviously it's, it's going to be a corrupt government so I was interested in seeing that a couple weeks ago I was like oh that looks interesting and I watched the trailer um, so I don't know if we could uh, if we could watch the trailer or not on here um, I don't want my video to get in any trouble or anything. Um, I don't think it would for a, a trailer, but um, we'll leave it. Um, but I'm gonna probably watch an episode of that here in a few minutes. And uh, the cleaning never got done last yesterday because uh, the 20 minutes after I was done my video, my cousin texted me and said that she was coming to pick me up. So I didn't really have time. I had to get ready to go. I had to back soda and get the alcohol ready and uh, stuff like that. We went out to uh, Subway and then we went back to her place and we watched uh, watched TV and listened to music and we put Jaden to bed and we started drinking a bit. Um, usually wait till he goes to sleep. Well, we might have a couple, like I might have a couple drinks while he's awake, but usually one of us always stays, you know, we don't have more than a couple drinks while the kid's up. So, after that we wait till he goes to sleep, but we usually don't start drinking until he's almost going to bed anyway. So, we put him in there, and then he's just like, he's really easy to put to bed. Like, I don't know, last night he kept waking up a bit, so we had to, my cousin had to go and put him back in a few times, but usually it's like the first time, and he's good. So, we had a good time. Uh, we only had a, we had a really small bottle of, uh, of alcohol, that was good. We got we got really trashed either way, though. Um, yeah, we don't certainly don't need a lot. So, yeah. Um, I really don't know what else I have today. That was what I did last night. Um, I did get a comment from a newer subscriber. They're kind of wondering what I do at work and kind of what we do. I know I get that comment pretty often because it is really hard for me to. Uh, to, uh, I don't know, explain it that everyone gets it at once, because obviously newer subscribers and stuff come along. So, um, he was commenting about that my boss was gone to Germany to get trained on our new machines that we're getting. We're getting two new huge machines that are going to, um, increase our capabilities, because right now our capabilities are, um, you know, capped out because of our machine size. So we're getting these two huge machines that are going to open it up to all the huge gears for us, which is going to open up another market. So, um, yeah, but at my work, uh, we make uh, our first plant, 
We make amphibious vehicles, off-road vehicles. They've, uh, they're the world leader in the off-road vehicle sector. Um, most of the markets in Malaysia and the Asia areas and stuff like that, um, if I'm if my memory serves correct, but it is they're more uh, more so in that area of the world for sure. Uh, search and rescue type stuff. Um, man, you could buy it for just personal for hunting or whatever. They're really cool. Um, they are quite expensive. Um, you can get one that's probably four or five years old for like eight grand. Um, so yeah, expensive. Brand new. I don't even know. I would definitely think they're close to twenty grand, if not more, for depending on which model you want. But think about it, the capabilities of what it can do are far more than a car. But um, it is still expensive either way. But um, our second plant, we make mostly gears and gears for transmissions, uh, gears for water pumps and vehicle engines. Um, man, shafts for. Uh, Actual shafts for <coughs> excuse me for industry type vehicles. We do a lot of parts and uh, gears for really large, like cat, tiger cat type um, off road machinery for like backhoes and just that kind of stuff. So you know when with the repaving roads, we probably make a lot of the gears that go inside of those machines um, and possibly even the, the transmission. So. Um, yeah, that's mostly what we do there. Um, are gears for customers too that can go in uh, many different things. Um, gears are very, uh, you know, kind of universal like that. They can be used for just a lot of different things. So it is. Uh, it's not, you know, it's not a huge market, but our plant is doing very well because not a lot of other plants do what we do, and that's pretty much, you know, a lot of the um, factories that are around right now are taking on a lot of the benefit of smaller factories that have gone under because of the economy so that's kind of leveled things out kind of gotten rid of some of the you know the extra weight kind of thing and just streamlined the industry a little bit more in the past couple of years it definitely has there's more competitive there's you know a few large companies now that are pretty much taking the global you know market there's still a lot out there but don't get me wrong but that number has been shrinking but our plant has been growing very steadily. We were up 60% in sales last year, which is huge. We had a record year. And um, they're looking to bring the company from a $26 million company to a 50 in the next several years. So it's going to be a pretty big company and a pretty well-known name in the next few years if things do go as planned. Uh, you know, they're redoing the entire plant, making us so efficient we're... You know, we're very competitive with China, which is a really good thing to say, because it's very hard to be competitive with China, if not impossible, but we are currently still in uh, competition with them and doing well, so, yeah, as of right now, things are doing really well. Sorry for anyone who's still watching that, they've heard this before, because I know I've said it all before, but for people who haven't, that's uh, kind of what I do. Um, I think I've told about as much as I really, really need to know about the job, and, you know, I can't talk about a lot, I can't talk about detail and specifics about things, but, you know, just for, uh, a lot of companies have legal things pending on their parts and, uh, their paperwork and all that stuff, so you can't, you know, show any of it or take pictures or anything like that, so, it's just, uh, it's illegal, so, we would lose contracts over that big time, probably lawsuits, because they're patented some parts, but, um, yeah, that's pretty much what happens at work. So now, uh, today I am going to try to clean. Uh, right now, probably I'm going to, uh, sorry, I keep rubbing my eyes. It's a, I'm going to start up this, uh, house of cards and see what this is like. Because I've been waiting for it for a couple of weeks, so I hope it's not as bad as what the ratings are, only 2 out of 5. So, it's HD and there's 13 episodes, so. I'm gonna see that, but yeah, if anyone knows Kevin Spacey in his recent movies, the last couple of years, he's he's always that easy or that evil, the evil boss or something like that. So I'm, I know in the horrible bosses, he was an evil boss, and he was a big time dick, and he was good at it. So <laughs> I was like, yeah, I'm gonna give that a try if he's in it, cause I just, I just like his uh, his acting personality. It's really uh, cutthroat and uh, it's 
really dominating. But anyways, I look like, like I said, I look like shit today, big time. Like, there's no other word for it. If I wake up in about two hours, I probably look a little better, uh, face and eye-wise. I'd be not so, like, you know, so... Anyways, hope you all have a good weekend. I am going to veg out today big time. Uh, try to rehydrate. I feel super dehydrated. Um, probably get something to eat within the next couple hours. I don't feel like my stomach wants it right now. I just, uh, yeah. This is what happens the day after drinking. I'm just a, a zombie. I didn't even, we didn't even do that much. So, there's like half the amount that I used to drink on weekends when I go out. So, uh, well, at least now I know that that's more than enough. <laughs> Anyways, that's it for today. And Twix is out. Oh, see you later. Um, do let me know if you uh, try out if you have Netflix and you watch House of if you do. Uh, if you do decide to try out watching the House of Cards. Let me know if you do like it. But I'll watch it now and uh, I'll probably review it tomorrow morning. But. I'll see if it's half decent. I might get through a few episodes today. There's only 13 on there, and uh, it started this year, so I'm assuming that there probably isn't going to be any more episodes for this season. But, oh, it's a series premiere. It's a Netflix original, so yeah, it'll only be on Netflix, I think that means. <laughs> but, anyways, I'll see y'all later. Bye!